Hi, I'm David Hildebrand from the University of Colorado, Denver. I'd like to tell you a little bit about next semester's Introduction to Philosophy class. I'm going to teach it as a hybrid. That means that we're going to meet in person for some of the time, and we're going to be online for the rest of the time. As far as in person, we're going to have 11 class meetings on campus in a classroom. We're going to get to know each other. We're going to get one another's perspectives on the material. We're going to be able to answer questions and get into conversation about philosophy. For the uh, rest of the time, it's going to be online. Now, three of those online sessions are going to be synchronous. They're going to be Zoom classes, but they're just going to be reviews. They're going to be reviews for upcoming exams and answering study questions, answering your questions, getting you ready for the next exam. As far as the rest of the class, it's going to be asynchronous online. I'm going to release a module every week. That module is going to have readings, it's going to have videos, it's going to have discussion questions and threads where we can interact in an asynchronous threaded discussion kind of way. We're going to have all of our exams and papers that we have for the class are going to be submitted online and we're going to have office hours on Zoom as well. So if you need to meet with me, you'll be able to meet with me online on Zoom if that's your preference. Introduction to Philosophy Hybrid is going to happen with the following four sections or parts. In part one, we're going to look at the question, what is the meaning of life? Are there certain activities which are constitutive of a meaningful life? Is there a need for all of those activities to combine into one single whole? Or could life be meaningful with lots of separate little sections uh, to life? Is a life of play a meaningful life? Or what about suffering? Does suffering contribute to or take away from the meaningfulness of a life? These are all questions we're going to get into in part one of the class. In part two of the class, we're going to look at the role of ethics in life. We're going to look back at the ancient Greeks, at the writings of Plato and the wisdom of Socrates, to, to look at the question of whether ethics plays a role in making up a meaningful life. In part three of the class, we're going to look at the question of pleasure and happiness. Are pleasure and happiness the same thing? Are they different? How do we pull those two similar terms apart? And in a society, in an economy, which is largely driven by consumer purchasing of services and experiences and, and objects, what does it mean to live a meaningful life when a lot of our options seem to be consumable in that way? Finally, in the fourth part of the class, we're going to look at the question of religion. Basically, we're going to look at the question of whether the belief in a higher being and a higher power or powers is necessary for removing ourselves from some of the despair we can feel in life, the existentialist kind of despair. Can a supreme being save us from despair? Or are there problems with the idea of thinking of oneself as subordinated or under the sort of guidance of a supreme being. Again, this is David Hildebrand, University of Colorado, Denver Philosophy Department, hoping that you'll sign up for Introduction to Philosophy Hybrid H01 next semester. Thank you.